guys, it's Beth here and today's video I'm going to show you how I got my hair to be this curly um yeah hopefully you guys enjoy this video um and yeah so this this started like last night so it's like heatless curls and all that jazz it takes a really long time because you have to sleep in it and then you get very curly hair see I mean it looked curlier earlier oh it's not even earlier I've just finished doing it but you'll see what I mean but yeah so let's let's get to it Okay, so here I am last night before washing my hair because you need to do this with wet hair. My hair is still slightly curly because I did it um, the, other, the other day. This is like second or third day hair. But yeah, so I need to wash it before and get it wet before I can curl it again. It's just showing off some of the curls and stuff. So here I go. I'm going to go wash my hair and a back look got wet hair it's cool now what i'm gonna do is i've got a hair wait no no what am i going no ah yes because i'm gonna be doing my hair i thought may as well do a face mask because i can leave that on to dry whilst i'm doing my hair now i'm putting on my hair mask and this is a um i briefly showed it it's a honey and avocado face hair mask that I've put on my hair. Um, after I've washed this off, I'm going to put some conditioner in my hair. And this is the Aussie Colour Mate Conditioner. It's what I've been using recently. So yeah, see you guys in a bit. Okay, hair washed, stuff washed out. It's all wet. It's been conditioned and stuff. Uh, need to dry it a bit. Well, not even dry. I just need to go get ready. One minute. Let's just sort of fix. There we go, that was really bad. But I'm gonna go to my room now. So stick with me and we'll do something cool with my hair. Oh, I got stuck on the door. Wow, I'm a weirdo. Here we are. What's with all the pointy finger guns, Beth? Seriously. Anyway, here we are in my room. I've just sort of took the towel off my hair oh look at that dramatic hair flip wow just running my fingers through my hair to get out some of the knots wow my neck is so long my head's itchy yay okay now what I've got is apparently hair on my fingers okay here we go this is the Aussie Miracle Hair Insurance Lightweight Conditioning Spray this is like I love this stuff at the minute I use it like constantly every morning before I do my hair I put it in it's a leave-in conditioning spray but because I've been dyeing my hair so much so I'll explain more about that in another video um, it's just sort of my way of making sure that my hair stays all nice so I use this every day at the minute so yeah head itch back so yeah that's lightweight conditioning spray done now to get knots out, I'm going to use my Lafro Comey thing to uh, make sure there aren't any big knots in my hair because when my hair is wet, it is normally really, really extremely knotty but because I've just run my fingers through it, on this occasion, it wasn't too bad, which is cool. So yeah, this is just me brushing my hair. Now I'm going to put some A Real Techniques Avon curl defining volumizing foamy stuff through my hair because if my hair's going to hold any form of curl it needs some sort of support in it so here we go I put that on really badly I know I'm just sort of scrubbing it into my hair because I realized how badly I did it this is me going to get some more to do it properly because I did it really badly and I still missed the other side Wow, it's not shampoo, Beth. It's hair foam. What is wrong with you? Yep, 
yet, still not, still not shampoo, it's still hair foam. Wow, let's get onto it, now I'm going to start curling it. Now to do this, um, I realised I didn't show anyone anything, but it's, I literally just twist my hair around lots and then make it into little buns and tie it off with elastics. And that's, that's basically it. I don't know why I didn't show anybody how to actually do this. Maybe that would have been a good idea. I'll do that another time. To be fair, I had some problems when it, you'll see later on when it comes to taking this out. Because I did too many too close together. Just, just wait until you see. It's a nightmare. Hi guys. So, I've just woken up. Literally. My hair has held up throughout the night. Um, I am gonna go make myself a cup of tea and something to eat and then after that I'll come back and take all these out. Yeah. See you guys in a little bit. Alright, I'm back. Time to uh, take all my stuff out there, get all my stuff ready because I need more mousse and and stuff to do this so just get all the I left on last night right let's get to this I'll take one out first to show you in slow motion well no I'm going to uh, let's start with the back this one's falling out. So what I do... I really don't know if I should have done this when I was like tying them up, but never mind. Take it out and I'll get some of the, the Avon one. Just a little... Just a little bit, little tiny droplet. You know, I think it's sort of smooths along it because it helps. We have some cowage. Look at that. Good, very good curls. I'm gonna take all this out and I'll be back. Right, so here I am taking out all of those little things. I don't know why I showed you me taking one of them out when I didn't know how to put one in. Oh at that point my mum phone my mum shouted me so I had to go and see her. I just didn't pause it or anything. So in a little bit, you'll see what I mean by I had a problem. There we go. I had a big nut and I had to chop off some of my hair because it got tangled. And yeah. And that small moment there, was be like that bit there that you just saw was um, a bit of my hair dropping out because I found where it was caught. So that's all the little things out now. I need to like calm it down a bit. What I'm gonna do is I just sort of run my fingers through it. Like so. Look at all the lovely curls. See now this is a bit mad, so I just need to sort of fix it. I'm just going to find where my parting is, so I know that's not where I have my parting. Oh gosh. What I'm going to do first, first before I is use some more of my light conditioning spray. Just so I'm able to sort of untangle it a bit. There we go. normally goes round about here. See last time I did this I put the parting in like I curled it with the parting but this time I didn't as you can tell I used so should I say so that's my madness <laughs> a bit. 
Now this side is a bit fluffy because I think this is the side that got tangled if you saw. I had to stop the video because it got really tangled and I'm now missing a big chunk of hair. But yeah, that's fine. It's fine. No one will notice. I'm going to use some of my normal mousse now just to be fine and just sort of like especially here. Bend that through it. And just to take some of the frizz out, especially out of here. Just give it a bit of a scrunchy about. Right now, I need to style it somehow. Actually, I don't really have many curls. Like, it hasn't curled very well, but on. Well, it has in bits. Just grab that and pretend I didn't say anything then. But there's one that's come out really nice and curly. Boom, look at them. They're like really good curls. They're all over the place and they're fun. Big curls. Boom. Now, what I like to do is I'm just gonna get this bit nice and loosely and just sort of pin it back. Oh, I found a ball of paper. Ah. Here's one. Just sort of loosely in this bit back. Like so, and then I can just sort of twist a few of these bits that are in my face. I think, yeah, that's the bit that got it funny. See, now it's all broken. It had a big knot in it. I don't know what happened, and I couldn't find the end. So I had to cut it. with this. It was a minute I start putting bits of hair into it to wrap it falls out. Let's try again. Oh it's staying like the yeah. other <sighs> do this takes a lot of work. It really does. Get a few of these little bits around through here. Give you a cute little curly twist. See, this side is much flatter, so I'm going to use some of this curl stuff. Meant to give volume too, so maybe it will. Or not. So, what I'll do just to make it look a bit even, when I find another bubble pin. There we go. Sort of clip that out of the way, like so. Get a few bits and then go wrap them around a bit. Go, this is 
Repin that in there. Yeah, it looks silly. This is literally how it looks. But in all fairness, once you've done something like this, without not single your hair up, hopefully. Once you like this, it is literally just about playing with it. It's actually really annoying because this bit's curled really well and this bit hasn't, so this bit just looks longer than the rest of it. Oh, oh my gosh. Need a mirror. Sort of pin it away. Right. So, still longer, but I suppose once it's destructive, it won't be as bad. So, just pin it on the way around. Does that look silly? Probably. Probably. Oh, right. I'm just gonna sort this out and then I'll be back. And I'm back. Put a nice hair rubbing in and that's that. Yeah, so, let me, guys, let me know what you guys think. Um, if you like this hairstyle. It's not like proper tutorial thing or whatever because it wasn't really one. Then just say and I'll make one. Um, yeah. I've got to go and get ready now for work. Um, but you guys, um, give this video a like if you liked it. Comment down below, subscribe, all that jazz. Um, you guys, go make yourselves a nice cup of tea or something. Go chill. I'll see you all next week sometime. Bye.